What's going on, guys? Uh, before we wrap up today's video, a couple of things. I want to give you a full transparency on trail cam updates, kind of show you the target bucks that we're still going after at this point in the season, kind of show you what's around, who's still showing up, some things like that. Also, all uh, October customers for the fly is going to go ahead and take care of the giveaway at the end of today's video, so stick around for that if you're an October fly customer uh, looking for the results of the giveaway. If you're new to my channel from this video, from hunting content, this is primarily a fly fishing channel. Uh, so that's what the whole giveaway thing is about. I often do uh, giveaways for people that buy flies uh, for, f for fly fishing here on the channel. So with that being said, let me adjust the screen a little bit and uh, we'll go ahead and start looking at these trail camera photos. There's not a whole bunch, pretty much... This is the last time that a shooter came through, guys. This was November 7th. Um, this is symmetry. This is that eight-pointer back coming through. Um, so there's symmetry. The last time symmetry came through was November 7th at 3 in the morning. Um, I don't know what's going on here with the... There we go. Um, so, yeah, but besides that, I mean, this is tonight right now. Nothing on there. Some does, some small bucks. I don't know what happened to the T9 buck. Um, but you can go back quite a ways here, guys. I don't know where Bull is. I don't know where the Jumbo 6 is. Um, and that buck that you guys saw in today's video, kind of that funky-looking 7-pointer, um, he goes by Oddball. He's a 2-year-old, and... Um, you know, is it likely that the neighbors are going to shoot him? Yes, it's extremely likely, and it sucks. And I think uh, New York State kind of has a toxic hunting culture um, where people think shooting a four-pointer is is equal or even better uh, than taking a big doe, right? And I totally get it. You can't eat the horns. But if you can't eat the horns, then why waste a small buck? You know, why waste the potential on a, on a nice buck? Just shoot a doe. I'll never understand it, but hey, everyone can do what they want. But yeah, guys, it's looking like maybe Symmetry will come back through. He was there a couple days ago. There's still some does coming through the sanctuary pretty regularly. Um, oddballs around, but he's not a shooter. We'll see. Now, here's the big thing. The big thing is, uh, tech well, technically, it's after midnight right now. Saturday, on Saturday, I'm going out to the Big Woods property to check the trail cam that's been in the woods for like eight weeks our fingers are crossed right now. Rifle season's coming up. We're hoping to see evidence of Ridge Runner, the buck that we saw um, last year that we got on trail cam, the deer that uh, my dad and I were trying to get at the Big Woods logging property. Man, what a nice eight-pointer he was last year. If that deer is alive, if he is in fact still on those back ridges at the logging property, man, that is going to be the number one target buck for certain so just to get you guys up to speed t9 buck pretty much gone symmetry eh, he showed up a couple days ago but he's been few and far between oddball seems like he's running the property pretty good but he's just not quite a shooter uh so at this point in time it's looking kind of thin on the farm um but it's 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 getting close to lockdown phase obviously you guys saw that video in with the buck chasing the doe down through the woods so, you know, if they're on a hot doe, it's going to be hard to get them on camera. They're probably just back in some bedding and some thick cover um, with whatever doe they found. So it could be could be a couple days until they kind of move off that doe, and then they're back on the search um, for maybe round two, and then we might get another opportunity on a, on a, on a better buck, on a shooter. So we'll see what happens with that. Um, so let's go ahead and take care of the fly giveaway. So for the month of October, we had 18 orders, so we'll do 1 through 18, and depending on which order it lands on, that'll be the winner. Let's go for it. 1 through 18, and we got a 4, number 4. So let me go to order number 4 here, 1504, and let's see who we got. Who do we got? Who do we got? Oh my gosh, no way. No way, that's pretty funny. Uh, Burke, man. Um, I, I'm not sure if you'll see this video, but I'll for sure, sh uh, shoot you a, uh, a message on Facebook. This, you know what, this makes it a little bit easier. Um, Burke is a, is a customer of, customer of mine. I've fished with him before. He's a good guy. 
and uh, I already have his contact information. So if it wasn't him, if it was um, one of the other followers, I was just going to have you guys try to comment below and, and get in touch and exchange an address and stuff like that. But this makes it a little bit easier. So um, glad that panned out. And uh, cool. There's uh, there's the giveaway. So that's done. You guys got the trail cam update, a little more hunting film, and um, the trout fishing videos will resume soon. I'm kind of letting the, uh, the brown trout uh, do their thing, guys. It's spawn right now, um, so I'm not trying to really mess with the fish. going to go ahead and finish hunting season hard, see if we can get one of these bigger bucks down, and then we're back to fishing. I'll see you guys in the next video.